being able to save specific pages in a long PDF file can make reviewing that PDF much, much quicker. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can save specific pages of a PDF file and then embed both of those into Notion, and we're starting right now. Subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay part of the conversation. For free Notion templates, check out the link in the description below. For this example, I'm actually going to use a Word document and I'm going to save that Word document. As you can see, it's six pages long and I'm going to save this as a PDF file. You don't have to save a Word document as a PDF, you could just have a normal downloaded PDF file. Once you have your PDF file saved, you can open that PDF in Chrome. Then when you go to Chrome, you can see it's got the six pages. You can go to print. And when you go to print, it allows you to save in a destination. So I'm going to save PDF and then I can customize the pages that I want. So I'm going to pick pages one to three. Then I can save those pages as a separate PDF file. I'm going to put one to three just so I know which pages this is going to show. Now when I go into Notion, I can use the slash embed block and then upload which file I want. And because they are individual files, I can upload just the one or I could upload both of them on the same page. So you can now see the document on the right is just the three pages that we've saved as the PDF file and the document on the left is the full six page PDF. If you want to learn more about how you can manage your files and folders in Notion, check out this video over here and I'll see you there.